Hey guys, and welcome back to our Europa Universalis multiplayer with me, NG Paradox. Uh, just quickly, we're going to go through everyone to introduce you to them, just in case you do not remember who we are. We have first up, Brittany, uh, Hello. played by Tanner. Hello, everyone. Next up, we have Holland, played by Jeronka. Hello. Then we have the religious Livonian Order, played by Toria. Hello. And we also have in Italy, Florence, played by Vujo. Oh. And last up, we have the irreplaceable Joe, playing as Ethiopia. So he gets two fucking titles now, and I only get one. This is bullshit. <laughs> okay. Can't here. be happy. I'm unpausing. Uh, who, who, got, who, who got two titles? Livonian Auditorio. Oh, yeah, I, I just meant the Livonian Audio was religious. Yeah, I know. I it's not a title. It's, it's more of an impediment. <laughs> Also, is 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 Mozart really a, a hello? Or is that like the celebrations phrase? Mozart. I think it's a celebration. Fuck. What is a hello in Jewish then? I, don't I have know. no idea. I always thought that was it. You know I can what? tell you Chinese idea. for hello. Fuck coming Jewish. I don't know the words for them. Therefore, it would just be more insulting to whoever's watching. If if you become Chinese, I can teach you some of those words. I can hello mm. stuff like that. Oh, Ni hao ma. You know, oh, that's actually, people, hard to say. Pe people in China just say ni hao. Ni hao. Now, see, if, I'm, I, I, if I said it, I would sound racist, and I don't want to do that. Or I could ask, like, ni shi huan ping guo ma. What is no. that? Probably still sound I, I just asked, do you, do you like apples? Oh, okay. I thought you were going to say something entirely different than that. <laughs> You're right. I thought you were insulting me, but... <laughs> I could ask you, you know, Nishif Wan, la la ma. I don't uh -huh. think it means, it means do, you li do you like lesbians? Well, then all, everyone <laughs> that knows was more of what I was thinking. Everyone knows the answer to that. Yeah. Which is. That was, <laughs> that was one of the first words I learned in China. You have weird. Uh, oh, whoa. Other. Someone's lagging behind, just pause it. That's all you gotta do. Yeah. Because I can't click anything. Oh, come on. Yeah. Yeah, please pause it. Right. Wait, did How I does that affect it? There we go. Oh, God, it out of your war. That's all right. Oh, what happened? Burgundian inheritance. So what happened to your war? Well, the war is, is continuing, but the now war. Austria will eat the rest and then it will just stop, basically. It will happen in a few days. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's unpause and... See what happens. Well, no, I'm I'm going to be independent. I'm just not going to get anything. That's a problem. Hmm. Uh, I know you're yeah. a bit sandwiched. Okay, but you're friends with Austria, right? Yeah. For now. But, I mean... Yeah. I can't do anything. I can't move my... Uh, now I can. Alliance breaking. Aragon doesn't like me. I can understand. That is a very unfortunate. Friends, you'll be fine. That is a very unfortunate so I situation. Won my war. Ah, freaking Burgundy! Why you gotta be like that? Oh, you killed him. Yeah, it was going too well for you. <laughs> you, you did too good. The game had to kick in the ball. It's only fair. Not really. It just didn't want you to form, you know, it didn't want you to form the Netherlands. Yeah. Well, I didn't want you to form it oh, this wow. hour. Yeah, Austria got all of it. Jesus. At least it's you're allied so to horrible. them. Why didn't that happen to me when I played Austria? Come on. <laughs> it did happen, I think, but you sold it no, to it Joe or whatever. Didn't. No, it didn't. Never happens. Never. Never happened. We had to destroy Burgundy the old-fashioned way. Yeah. I'm kicking them in the shin until they died. Well, guys, I just lost his Brittany. It's all over. What? <laughs> it's still no. You're Provence? still fighting Provence, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna Provence. lose. You're gonna lose the Provence? Hey, Lorraine, yeah. What happened? Yeah. Well, I didn't think that France would let them through, and well, they did. Ah. And so yeah. Not oh, cool. Get more troops. If it's you get eaten, good. you can just jump on back as someone else, just counting one failure. And we will all laugh at you for that them. failure. It'll be fine. 
Don't worry, everyone's having a hard time. I think Moscow is going to I'm steal not. Novogrodian land from me. I'm, I'm having a really big problem here. Need to get an annex and everything. <laughs> so oh, difficult. Yeah. Not going my way. Now we see who the good players are. Let me just say I've won my war with no issues. What, I've not got quite. I, I have oh, quite an easy oh, area for the beginners. Okay, sorry. Then I have lots of big back. enemies around me later. No, all the alliances are breaking. You still have France. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the other one's broke. This is terrible. You know, wh why would Austria um, destroy your alliance? There's probably a reason for that. Well, GG, Jeronka, you tried. I need to uh, kill Austria. Good luck. No one can say you didn't try. Well, you could, uh, it just wouldn't be true. To be honest, if you have France by your side, you should be okay at defeating Austria, I think. Oh, France should be Austria right now, at this point. The problem with Austria is they always have tons of allies. Yeah. yeah. If you could get the rivals on your side... Allies. If you could, for oh, example, hungry, yeah. Bohemia... Also, also, I was hoping that, that they could... That we would stay allies, so I wouldn't have to uh, get the unlawful territory thing. Although I'm, I'm not sure if that still they, they keep yeah, changing they things around. I don't. Know. Ah, okay. You can avoid it by being at war. Right. So you start two wars, finish one core stuff, and then finish the other. Yeah. Because it only works on stuff that isn't your core. Okay, let's try bumping the speed up again. Really? Yeah, you're just gonna have to redo that. I, I apologize, but uh, I'll, I'll try to fix it for next time. Glad yeah, we got it yeah. up anyway. <laughs> the heck is going on? Chaos. Yeah, just right there we are. Always taking over my screen, all them pop ups. <laughs> Can't believe how bad my general is. <sighs> just. <laughs> <laughs> One bloody pip. You'll live. But if you don't, you can blame that general at least. I will. At least you have someone he's to def blame. He's definitely not the next Hannibal. I can tell you that. Yeah. So, um... Not. Toriel? Yes? Do I have to become Jewish? Yes. Is it your guess? Are you talking the game or in real life? Because you see, the problem is, they'd have to act to, for them to actually be a thing. They would have to have loads of land in my territory for me to accept the demands. Because um, Coptic isn't in the religious group, same religious group. I, they would have to have the dominant religion in Ethiopia for me to switch. I don't know how it changed in the last patches, but a few patches ago, um, when your religious rebels took over a province, they automatically changed this religion to their religion. And if you let so your... That means they would have to sit through all of my provinces, which yes. would take fucking ages. That's how I did it with the Ottomans, when I made Ottomans That's Catholic. Like I don't like effort. Anna, how are you doing? Are you, are you able to defeat them now? I think I'm going to switch to Verdan. Ah... Uh. <laughs> I can peace out with them, but um, oh, actually, I just beat their army somehow. You know that yeah, random glitch where the army arrives at the same day they lose a battle and they just automatically. Oh retain. yeah, no, they, they, yeah. <laughs> Bad luck, good just, luck. Just count yourself. Maybe just... you can win, or at least get a white piece. Uh, no. guys, See, when I players. when I planned this war, they had a total of seven thousand guys, and I had eleven. And now all of a sudden, they have over twenty. Hmm. Because oh, they, they must have more. Yeah. <sighs> so also, Toro, there's another problem with this: is that I could would convert that province quicker than they would probably have brought, uh, revise up against me. You keep cancelling it and then putting it back again. Bloody Austria! Waste of money. So though. huge. <laughs> oh <laughs> wow, Fiodoro is getting destroyed. But he's trying to take down Crimea. They actually yeah. got a lot of occupations. Mm. Yeah, yeah sadly they've been course. occupied there. None of oh, them... Teutonic Order looks like they're going to get eaten. Yeah, I'm waiting to jump on that. I Unfortunately, I accepted an alliance and now I have a truce with them. But I might be uh... able to still get a bite out. After this is done. Try not to take too big of a bite, mate. Don't be mean. Yeah, there's... You don't there's... get indigestion. 
coalition going on well. then later if I do that. Hmm. Can I get a loan analyzed with Poland? Not really. Muscovy? Almost. Just almost. Well, if I improve relations sufficiently, I might be able to get it. You don't I... need that. You're fine. You'll do fine. <laughs> really don't think so. Right. Let's see how Lubeck is doing. Doubt my merchants aren't even put on. Sorry? Yeah, you might want to do that. Usually they put them on at the beginning, so I don't you normally they're fine. Yeah. Actually I think I'll switch my merchant. Oh maybe not. It doesn't matter that much. But what if it does matter and you're just ignoring it? Hmm. Ethiopia, can you can you send the money from your trade node up north? Fuck off. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I will do everything in my power to ensure it doesn't get sent north. How about that? Damn, I should have told them to go south. Then we've gone north. Damn it. Yeah. I do know that Ethiopia is a start node, so I can only stop the trade, keep the trade there. Oh, it is a start node. I didn't know that. Come on, Muscovy, be my ally. I was hoping to get a Neva in, in Germanland from Novgorod, but it's probably going to Muscovy. Yeah, you need to act pretty fast on that. Wow, they've not attacked Granada yet. I think they now start a truce, with a longer truce. Yeah. yeah. Ah. I, okay. Until, until forty-eight. One more year. Okay. Oh, well, not even. I, I want I want Castile and Portugal to go to war with Morocco because I want to attack um, Tlemcen, but they're allied to Morocco, so I want them to attack Morocco so I can attack them. But Portugal is very unlikely to do that. They get tons yeah, of mission I'm just, missions. Just waiting for that. Okay. Oh, if Austria dies now, there's going to be succession war between Hungary and France. <laughs> if, you had, for Austria. if you had an ally, which would be France, France with a personal union over Austria, you could just kill everyone. Oh, wow. Brittany. Jesus. Oh, oh my. my. <laughs> so I just looked over and I was like... Under someone. <laughs> this seems <laughs> terrible. terrible. I was like, wait, where did they go? Can you possibly... Maybe if France declares war on them, they will release provinces for you. Yeah, my, my hope is, is eventually they'll go to war with Provence and I'll be able to take some of it back. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. To look at these things. This is... I thought I had them bad, but nope. This is officially pretty bad. I have 12 development. I have... Yeah. I only have, I think, 8 loans out. Seven loans oh, out. Bad. It's doable. Seven loans. <laughs> We're fine. I mean, you are going to have to wait like a hundred years before you can even colonize, so... Why? Well, to actually be able to reach there. Yeah, that's probably going to take a while. Not if you go north. Yeah, I might go Greenland and then eat west. Oh, you know what? But once you have one province, you can easily move your capital to the new world, so... Yep. Maybe that's... And I'll forget about all you fools over here. Do well, you wanted thing. to do that anyway, I guess, so... Yeah, oh, I knew I wasn't going to win this game over here. Bloody hell. Novgorod is not annexed by Muscovy, but now they're allied with Lithuania. That would be the death of me. <laughs> uh, this is uh, not going well, it seems. Yeah, whose <laughs> idea was this? I think Joe's I, I doing fine. I'm, I'm enjoying this. <laughs> Why would you want easy starts? You guys gotta learn to play. I don't like these starts. These starts are boring, but. Oh, no. These starts really are boring because, like, as Austria, you just ruffle stomp everything, then it gets boring. <laughs> my Quora Kwan Lu is probably my most enjoyable campaign. For the fun. Okay, let's let Jiroka catch up. You think it's that, um, that audio software that's doing that? 
to you, Jeronka? What? Because you're lagging behind more than usual. Do you think it's that uh, voice chat software? I think... Yeah, I think so. Well, I'm not using the app anymore. I'm using the uh, browser now, but I, I think it, it must mm -hmm. be it. I don't know. I think we should try TeamSpeak next time. I also need to sort it out. Just mm -hmm. But yeah, it does seem worse than, than usual. Because we have yeah. to, usually we just stay at speed two and maybe three, and this at time least, it's yeah. one, yeah. two, not two, three. Oh, Fezzen is Mamluk's vassal. I didn't even notice that. Yeah. Hmm. I just got the bottom. I guess be careful. Oh, they are. What's wrong with that? Yeah, that is dangerous. Wait, uh, a temporary alliance is allowed when there's a joint goal in mind, like to destroy Mamluks. <laughs> um, I don't I, mean an actual alliance, I mean a... Collusion. I, like war, I mean, like a separate war. Yeah, we, we we could we could accidentally declare war at the same time, you know. <laughs> yeah, I think. Yeah, you can't you can't prevent this, so I think it should definitely be allowed. Uh, collusion is allowed, not just allying each other. That's because uh, the alliances br um, protect us in case of a player wanting to fight another player. So, uh, goals that eventually mean eventually have the same outcome are not a problem then. Yes. Even if we did help each other win this war, it would just cause problems between us eventually anyway. Also, coalitions are allowed. Yes. Yeah. Helen of Ethiopia. Can I afford this bitch? What bitch are you talking about? No, I cannot. She costs four point six gold a month. It's Helen of Ethiopia. Um, it's an um, advisor. Diplomat, but... oh, oh, yeah, I see. Jesus Christ. For half the cost, right? Yeah. yeah. Still four fucking gold a month. My siege is going to take bloody ages. <laughs> I'm still doing right. the first siege. I feel your pain. Actually, no, I don't. Oh, finally. That's problem, isn't it? You notice how sieges have a cannon sprite even before cannons are invented? Yes. Pretty funny. <laughs> but you do know can there were cannons at this point that were just not mobile. I'm pretty wank. What's? Yeah, dead Archibus is at this point. Huh. Or at least the very, very shit ones that Henry Tudor wanted. Which Henry Tudor? Seven, I think. I know there was really shitty guns around at this point. Really, really shitty ones, but still. China had fireworks, I believe. Like, fire cannons at this point, didn't they? Yep. Yeah, they're, they're the ones who kind of make gunpowder big and then it spread through the Silk Road and got to Europe. And we turned them into um, sort of guns, I guess. Badass cannon, motherfuckers. Classic Europeans. <laughs> Making death out of everything. There it goes. Ah, that explains where the Americans got it from. No. Got what from? <laughs> the need to make everything into killer machines. Ew. I think just, that's just human. Yeah. Last time I checked, I didn't want to kill my neighbor. Are you sure? Yes. Oh, yeah, really, yeah. really, really think about it. Really, agree, mate. Yeah, think I would about it. But <laughs> think of it as 300 years ago, and there's only one rabbit. He's going to kill and the there's... rabbit, or you're going to kill the rabbit. Or you could kill him and Holy the, shit. the rabbit. <laughs> Double the meat. No, I, I wouldn't kill. I would keep the rabbit, breed it, and kill him. But and eat what him. if there's only one? Yes, not a second rabbit. Uh, I'd eat it because rabbits one. taste fucking gorgeous. Mm. Rabbits, though, don't they burn more calories than they give? It's like a weird type of meat. Mm, don't think so. Really? No clue about that, but I knew that they taste fucking gorgeous. So do pigeons, though. You people. Never tried pigeon. I think I've never tried pigeon, but there's a lot of shady restaurants <laughs> here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've probably never. I tried mean, I've, I've, I've eaten. Popular. I've eaten a few weird foods in China, though. I've eaten crocodile. Ooh, that's, that's not crocodile. that weird. Crocodile isn't weird. You just got a Kenyan. What? Eat that. Yeah, we really? have crocodile yeah. a lot. Yeah. Is it okay. good though? I guess if you go somewhere where there's a lot of crocodiles, I, I, you'll have. Crocodile. I thought it was quite nice. I would describe it as like a sea pig. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know why you call it a sea pig, it's more like a river pig. Yeah, you That's think it would taste dirty. Almost like a catfish? 
Never but unfortunately, had ladies and gentlemen, we are at the end of oh, the no. part. We hope you guys have enjoyed and will continue to enjoy the series. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next part. See you guys then. Yeah, see ya. Bye. Bye. Bye.